I'm Amy Tiadrisi, live at the breaking news desk where we are tracking wildfires raging along the western United States. You know, this hot, dry weather is really taking a toll with wildfires in California, Oregon, and Washington. Several fires broke out in our state over the weekend. Uh, authorities are telling residents to immediately evacuate the area along Lake Chelan. This is the south area that they're most concerned about. There's a new fire burning near 25 Mile State Park. To the hills east of Lake Chelan, the Chelan Hills fire has burned about 1,800 acres and is now just about 40% contained. The Forest Service says an active fire is burning in heavy timber some 13 miles west of Mazama, Washington. Six trails are closed, including the Cutthroat Lake Trail. Now let's go to Northern California, where more evacuations overnight were caused because of that car fire burning in Redding. So far, it's burned about 95,000 acres. It's destroyed 650 homes. At least six people have died. 11 people are still missing. More than 3,000 firefighters and more than 300 engines are on this fire line battling the fire. 17 helicopters are dropping water from the air. Stream is not even the right adjective to use anymore. It's just an understatement because fire is it's so explosive now in California. Well, the car fire is just one of 17 wildfires burning in California right now. Over the weekend, a second firefighter died fighting a huge wildfire near Yosemite National Park. The 33-year-old was killed when a tree fell on him near the fire line. This is likely a hand crew there right on the front lines of this fire. And also firefighters are dealing with hot, dry conditions and terrible air quality. I'm going to keep an eye on all these fires this morning for you. Back to you in studio.